Hello. Um, I wanted to um, build on some of the concerns that everyone has on the BLM movement, but I also wanted to go further back to the, some of the history of the Marxism. And then it went to critical theory. And then it, the watered-down version was critical um, race theory. And then we go down and we have other, pro other programs. And I would ask the school board that if we are going to um, select something that is going to have a, a narrative, a conversation that addresses all races, that it be empirically based, is researched and it is cited. Also too, the goal of all of these programs is to state that you are only free if you overthrow these organizations, okay, these systemic organizations. My opinion is that our school system is a systemic organization in itself. The police department is a systemic organization in itself. So we have to ask ourselves, is Sarasota schools racist? Are your teachers racist? Is, or have there been any um, incidents of racism? And if there have been, then we need to find a program that is cultur culturally based curriculum that does not pull out one race. Um, so then our goal, I believe as a systemic organization, it should be, here's Sarasota going to be the district that is the calm in the storm and states, we are addressing or exploring any type of cultural bias within our systemic environment. And I do wanna give an example that how this has gone from the teacher training and then some of the kids have, were telling us that it's happening and then you guys have been become aware of some of that. But it's, it's coming our way. And the thing is, is that there's a shooting with two police officers. And what you didn't see on the video is that the protesters were um, shouting the police officers' names, but then they were shouting their wives' names and then their kids' names. And then they were, shoot, they were shouting where their, their kids went to school at. So they were told to put name tags, even permission to put over that. So that is what you did not see on some of the videos and on mainstream um, uh, media. So we need to be the calm in the storm. We need, to, we need to stand our ground and we need to decide what we are going to do. And Florida state law says, if you are going to have a curriculum, that it is, has to at least have a reviewer of one parent. So depending on what category you put this in, and Ms., uh, Mr. Aspen, I appreciate you tabling the B, BLM because there is a shift occurring.